Welcome back to Watch Dogs 2 and the No Compromise DLC. In the last episode we began Moscow Gambit and we finished by running away after destroying the Bratford drugs and cars. Drugs and cars indeed. Today the mission continues as we look to finish the Watch Dogs 2 series. But if you have enjoyed this series or any content on the channel, don't forget to subscribe, a like on the episodes does help the algorithm and ring the bell to not miss an upload. Okay. We just need to get away enough so the mission completes, and then we should be able to speak to DedSec and find out what we're doing next. There we go, mission complete. Time to speak to DedSec. Yeah. Alright, Bradford's frame job op is over, along with a lot of their product. This is gonna cost them big. I hacked C2S traffic camps to hunt down our fire bomber. He's definitely Bratva. I tipped off the cops and sent them all his records. Let's hope they take just a few bites out of our Russian friends. Just to be safe, I put a notice out to our DedSec channels for everybody to stay alert. Meanwhile, the Bratva hackers are completely killing their own network by mistakenly attacking China. Watching the shots go back and forth is strangely soothing. Kid, we make a good team. In fact, you remind me of a young Raymond Kenny. Well, minus the beard. And the swagger. I'm not a kid. Can you teach me to swagger? Oh, without a doubt. Ah, damn it. Everyone got their shit done but me. Still, I promise mine's going to have the most bang for the buck. Marcus, I need your help. Meet me in Marin. Hey, Wrench, I see you. Marcus, you have the rare pleasure of watching a demolition master in his natural environment. Damn, this baby's gonna pack such a punch! Now, the thing about these crazy mafia hooligans, they are always stocked up on the best boom-boom ingredients. And I've thrown a little of my own magic dust in there to sign my art. <laughs> it's a privilege watching the master at work. Whose place is this anyway? Uh, my best guess? The Bratva probably use these places to put up the Russian Mafia's most powerful cretins when they come down to babysit. They're filled with the best shit money can buy, but currently vacant. We need to keep them that way, which is where you come in. Now, I've got dead sex setting of similar bombs and similar Bratva houses all around the neighborhood, but we need you to draw attention away from us. I like attention. I'm on it. Can't believe I'm doing this to myself. I will <sighs> Here goes. We need to drive around, keeping the brat for our attention on Marcus to enjoy some incredibly bad driving. Wait, they took the bait. Excellent. The more they're trying to kill you, the more time I have to fuck with their toys. <laughs> Glad I could help, man. Yeah. 
usually end up getting shot. Yeah, I hear you. Some more. No, I call dibs. Uh, no. We should sink the damn thing. Aww. Won't that kill the fish? We don't want to kill the fish. Marcus, grab the boat and bring it with you. We'll leave it for the police, courtesy of DedSec. That'll get the heat off our backs and put it back on the Bratva, where it belongs. You can't argue with that. Send me the cords and I'll deliver it to our little park. See you all there. It's not quite over. We now need to go and steal a boat from the Bratva themselves. And it is just over there. The quickest way across, I'm guessing swimming. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to swim across and hopefully get this boat away without causing too much trouble for ourselves. We are highly wanted currently, but that's because of us driving around and keeping the Bratva busy. Okay, we've been spotted. I didn't notice there were people on the roof over there. That could be an issue. Uh, they're snipers as well. I wish I'd seen them sooner. I may not have gone this close. I would have gone further away. Okay, can we avoid the gunfire? That's the important thing at the minute. So far we are. It's just really annoying that they're there. I kind of thought there won't be anyone on the roofs. We're okay. We'll swim across. Happy day straight in. Um, but not quite as simple as that. We are distracting them for the time being just to make our lives a little bit easier. The fact they're going to be looking for us now is going to cause us a massive issue. But if you send in another gang, that should help. Now, the doorway for the boat is blocked. We need to get an access key, uh, which is over there. Hopefully the other gang comes, starts shooting, takes their attention away from us. That will help us immensely. Okay, where can we climb up? The key that we need is there. I can't see anyone else at the minute. Uh, okay, let's just have a look around. Is anyone else nearby? So it's inside the building by the looks of things. Uh, there's a door we can open, but other than that, I think they are all being drawn away though. We may be okay here. Just gotta find a way up. We got up here, we can. Okay. Oh, there's a grenade being thrown in by someone. Let's go back into the water, I think. See a grenade flying up over there. Right, we should be okay. I think they're all being distracted. So while that's happening, we should be able to go and get this key without too many issues, is my hope. Uh, I know they're coming back already. I like, okay. The other gang didn't last long by the looks of things. It's a little bit annoying. I thought that, would, that fight would have lasted longer and allowed us more time. But it's not to be. Right, we've got to be quick about this. That's the key, that's the access key just there. We've got it now. Okay, access key is ours. We just need to head to the boat, potentially. That's all we need to do. So let's find our way across. There's a guy there. Be a little bit wary of him for the minute. No, we're being jammed. There's someone else here with a jammer. That's an issue. We're still in the jammer signal. We need to move. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, this hasn't quite gone to plan. We did work really well to get in here without being seen, and then... Now the jammer's going to call us oh, a dead end. A dead end. Where's this jammer guy? Need to breach him, ideally. We need to turn this jammer off. I thought we had this in the bag. Once we got the code and we were happy, I thought this would all be simple. 
but not quite. Okay. We've breached and we can turn off the jam, which is what we need. Where's he? Is? What's he doing? I need him to go away. We called in a gang on him as well, just to try and, you know, help us. Problem is, we're now in the jamming area, which is bad for us. He's gone upstairs. Okay. Hopefully the other gang will turn up and draw their attention once again. We now need to find a way past. That, ja that jammer's going to come back on. It's already on, to be fair. We need to find a way. I don't, I don't, it doesn't necessarily need to stop the jammer, but we need to get past this guy. We've turned it off. Um, what else do we need to do? We can't do anything else to this guy other than turn the jammer off. He's coming back down. Turn it off again. I think we're going to have to take him out. I think that's our only real course of option here. Let's go. That's the jammer guy down. The jammer will come back on. Um, but as long as we're away from him, we're okay. Okay. Right. We're upstairs, which isn't ideal. But we can still find a way to the boat, I think, from here. Be careful. There's no one else around. There's a grenade being thrown below us. That's fine. So the auntie shoe boys have come in to help take them on. So we'll leave them to do what they've got to do. We are being spotted. Can we just run? I think we can run for the boat. They're being attacked by the Arthur Shoe Boys. We should be fine. Although we are being shot at. Okay. I think we're in. This is the boat. Uh, that didn't go to plan. <laughs> Falling in instead of actually getting on the boat. We were trying to get on the boat so we can take it. If they get into here, we're in trouble. So we need to get on this boat and out as quickly as possible. Hack the doorway open. Let's go. Boat is out. I've got the USS Drug Belly. We're <laughs> bringing her to you. Just in time. We're setting up now. Ready? I'm way ahead of you. <laughs> Now that was an extremely explosive finish to not just this mission, but also the series. That is Moscow Gambit finished. That is no compromise DLC done. And Watch Dogs 2 has come to an end. Now we're not going for the Platinum because of the multiplayer trophies. We'll talk about that more in the next episode, which will be the look back at Watch Dogs 2. But thank you to everyone who's watched this series. I hope you've enjoyed it. We will be moving on to Watch Dogs Legion next. So look out for that. And if you're looking forward to that series, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to not miss an upload. We'll see you next time for our look back at Watch Dogs 2.